You are making a web map of historic lakes and you want the pop-ups to include a picture of each lake. You'll start by adding the data to ArcGIS Online. On the content page, click New Item and add historic lakes.zip. The file type is shapefile. Make sure you add it as a zip file and create a hosted feature layer. Edit the title and summary fields and click Next. The item page appears. The item type is listed as Feature Layer Hosted. Hosted items are source layer items. You will only see the hosted label when an item is hosted and it is owned by you. Because this layer is hosted and owned by you, you are able to manage the capabilities and the schema of the data, not just the layer properties. You'll take advantage of this later when you'll edit the data to include images. Click the Data tab to view the Layers table. This layer has only two fields. Click the Visualization tab to view the data on a map. Click one of the features to view its pop-up. You would like to add pictures to the pop-ups. Open the pop-ups pane. Click Add Content and Image. Here you can enter a URL for the image, but if you use this method, every feature will show the same image. You want to show a different image for each lake, so this is not the correct method for your needs. Click the Data tab. You can add pictures to each pop-up by editing the layer's attributes. Click Options and Add Field. The Add Field option is available because the layer is hosted and is owned by you. Add two new string fields to the feature layer, one to store the URLs of pictures and one to store text that gives credit for each picture's source. Populate the new fields with URLs and credit text for each image. When using images and maps, it's important to include information that credits the people or organizations who created them. The image for the last lake is not available as a URL. You'll add the image as an attachment instead. Click the Overview tab. Attachments are enabled on the sublayer level. This feature layer has only one sublayer, historic underscore lakes. Click it to view its settings. Click Enable Attachments. Next, you'll return to the table. You can access the data for the sublayer directly from the sublayer page without returning to the main page. Click Data. The table has a new column for attachments named Photos and Files. In the Lopnur row, click Add. Upload lopnur.jpg. Update the image source column as well. Now that you've added images to the data, you can include them in the pop-ups. Click the Lopner feature in Western China. The pop-ups show the new fields as well as the attached picture. Attachments are shown by default in pop-ups. For the other features, the picture links are shown, but not the pictures themselves. You'll configure the pop-ups to display the images. In the pop-ups pane, click Add Content and Image. Next to URL, click the Fields button and add the picture field. All of the pop-ups now show images. Above the map, click Save. Your changes are saved to the feature layer. When this layer is used in a web map, the pop-ups will already be configured to show the images. In this tutorial, you learned two ways to add images to pop-ups by adding fields for image URLs and by adding attachments.